area of this trapezoid. Did you say you can't figure out the area of a trapezoid? Yes. Well, if you know the equation, that actually is pretty easy. So, say you had another trapezoid, exactly the same size. So then, if you flip it upside down, and put it next to each other, what does that make? It makes a parallelogram. Right. So, you, do you know how to find the area of a parallelogram? Yeah, you multiply the base times the height. Right. So, we already know the height, right? Yeah. Which is three inches. So now we need to figure out the base. We know one of the bases, which is five inches, but we need to know the other. Well, this base happens to be exactly the same as that base. So, what is this base? It's seven inches. Right. So, what would you do to find the base of this parallelogram? You add them together. Right. So, the beginning of the equation is base one plus base two, which is twelve. Right. So, now, since you know the height, three inches, and you know the base, uh, 12 inches. So what would you do to find the area of the parallelogram? You'd multiply it by h. Right, or by the height. So you'd multiply the base by the height. Which is 36. Right, so now we have the area of a parallelogram, or the area of two trapezoids. So now we need to find the area of one trapezoid. How would you do that? You would divide it in half. Or divide it by two. Right. So now this is, this is the equation. Base one plus base two times the height divided by two. And that is how you find the area of a trapezoid. Which is 18 square inches. Right.